Hello friends, I am Devashish and today I am going to show you how to install Linux operating system. Here I am using VirtualBox for this installation. I am going to create a new machine for new installation. Then click on new. Then provide a machine name like I am just using Red Hat. Uh, 6.4 version. Uh, we have to select the amount of memory, physical memory, which is RAM. I'm just using, uh, I'm giving around 2 GB. So you can drag this point or you can manually type over here. This uh, operating system recommended the minimum space of hard disk, which is 8 GB of hard disk space. Click on create, then next, then next. Select a dynamically allocated for increased hard disk space. I am giving around uh, 16 GB. Here you can also drag uh, this button or manually type. Now we have to provide the path of image file for virtual box only. Otherwise uh, simply we can boot from image disk uh, or uh, bootable pen drive to optical drive or USB port. Uh, click on uh, click on start button to start the machine. It's uh, boot from image file. You can see that here we have to choose option for first time installation. We have to select second option and press enter. Uh, it will take a uh, few times uh, to initializing. Here we can see that Linux want to check media before installation, but here we are not using any kind of media like optical devices or USB. So that's why we simply skip. Then click on next. Select language. I'm uh, I'm just using uh, the English language. Uh, next, and uh, for first time installation and basic installation, select first option and then next. Click on discard the data and then next and again next. You can put computer name over here select your uh, time zone and uh, next Enter a root password. I'm giving a simple password which is one two three four five six. And then click and uh, use any anyway. For first time and a basic installation, select this option and next. Now we have to create partition. This is fully different from Windows partition. Now click on create. Then select standard partition, which is, which is already selected. Otherwise, we have to select this uh, standard partition, and then create, and select swap. This is a swap partition from a uh, file system, and uh, size should be double of physical memory. I'm using a uh, 2 GB memory. That's the reason I'm. Is uh, here giving 4 GB of swap partition. Click on again create button. 
then create drop down the mount point and select boot we are going to create a boot partition size uh, I'm giving just uh, 100 MB for a uh, boot partition then OK the next again click on create and to do create a new partition drop down the mount point and select root and I'm giving here around 10 GB then OK last partition I'm gonna create is home partition we have to follow the same procedure and I'm gonna give uh, 2GB and then create and next and uh, we have to format the disk as like windows after format the disk uh, it's asking for what kind of installation we want to like basic server and uh, database server web server identity identity management server or virtual virtualization host desktop software development workstation or minimal for a uh, first time I should gonna I would like to click on desktop then click on next and the installing process uh, start you, you can see that and uh, it takes time to complete the installation we have to wait for that 